and welcome to another episode of Elite Dodgeball. I'm Benny and with me is Glenn. In today's episode, we have you the Elite South Series Round 1, Round 2 of the Winner's Bracket. We got the number 2 seed Dodge Tronic from Memphis and number 3 seed Hitman from San Antonio. Both these teams get ready for dodgeball and we're off. Burden looks like it's on Hitman's side and a quick throw off the pitch there at Dodge Tronic. But nice block by Hitman. Looks like it's, it's even up right now and the Burden's on Hitman's side. Looking to spread the burden ball around as they team up on the far side of the screen and a good throw, a triple throw, all, all team members throw and hit Oh, Hitman. nice catch. Almost dropped it, but snagged it at the last second. And it was a player swing. Even though they had a player out on a hitman, the catch was made. He wasn't out yet, so he doesn't get to come back in. It looks like Johnny Castillo's out for hitman, captain of the team. Oh, oh! Nice catch by Tracy. Has that play by Tracy right there, just reeling it in. Tracy's a clutch catcher for Dodge Tronic. Dodge Tronic back up to five players now. Hitman down to three as Dodge Tronic's holding the center line. Oh, did he just kick the ball? Maybe he's trying to use it as a distraction. More of, I guess, uh, an unspoken rule than an actual written rule. And a quick double throw in the corner there, but Hitman nice able to survive. Loop. And Tracy... Trying to get another catch. You look like it got him right in the, in the jewels, the family ones. Dodge coming a up. quick throw and even better dodge, but Ben got Nick right there. And McCoy on the on dodge trying to just misses. Nice dodge. Oh, he got. He, oh, and it looks like the ref just it, called him out. He was able to jump over the first one. We got nicked by the second throw. Hitman down to two players. They survived the onslaught as Dodge Tronic has been whittled down to three. And now down to two. Burden's on their side. Two on two. It looks like it's rolling back to Hitman's side. Hitman's side has Burden. There goes Rachel with the throw, and she's a clutch catcher for Dodge Tronic. And there she goes. She just got one. Bring it even and back up. And Dodge Tronic ends it. Rachel hitting her teammate in the back there. Kills her, kills her evened up four to four, but Dodge Tronic overcomes it with the one more catch. Do yeah, a extra player in makes it easier on their team. Swinging momentum twice was huge for them. Let's see if Hitman bounces back. Hitman takes a quick pitch, burden on their side, and another quick throw by Dodge Tronic, getting a player out right off the break. He didn't keep his eyes up. He kind of hit his face behind the ball while he was trying to block. Got to keep your eyes up. Now Hitman holding the neutral zone. We'll have Burden. Nice Quick catch. throw. Tracy again with a great catch. Reeling it right in there. Oh, and he caught it. Tried to get him with the cross throw, but he caught it. That was a quick exchange there. Wow. And just like that, they took out at least four players on that exchange there. And Glenn. that's it. Catch for the win. Oh, Ben just ducked down, and it would have been a screen but the other player was far enough back to where that screen didn't really matter, and Dodge Tronic... With six players remaining. Man, three catches that game. I believe they had five catches total throughout the whole series, and those five catches proved to be huge to propel them to victory right Seven there. Seven kills, five catches. All what the a dominating performance all by the, Dodge Tronic. All the... Hitmen will find their way to fight back through the loser's bracket. Yeah, it seemed like that last game just didn't go. It was a bad exchange on a, on a counterattack, and they just lost it. This has been an episode of Elite Dodgeball. Please like and subscribe our YouTube page. Follow us on Twitter. Like our Facebook page. Or for more information, visit www.elitedodgeball.com. Thanks for watching.